Believe it or not, what we're about to show you is how we do marketing for a $30 million company. You're not gonna believe what you see. Yeah, man, I like that with that into your chest. It's really nice. Very flattering. Hey, today we're gonna show you how to make an online ad in four easy steps. How many steps but are you Safety first. Safety first. So basically, step one to making an ad is you wanna get people's attention. You don't wanna be the same old guy who pops up on YouTube and is like, hey, I'm driving a Lamborghini. Do you wanna drive a Lamborghini too? You don't wanna be that guy. You wanna be the guy that's like, hey, but, see I got your attention. <laughs> that's, that's rule number two though. What's that? What's rule number one? Have fun. Exactly, so first step is have fun. Rule number one two. in don't marketing 101 is half, is this 101 or is this advanced? Uh, AP marketing history right medium, here? Medium. Okay, well, <laughs> rule number two, you gotta do something crazy! But you don't wanna be too crazy because it's played out. False. You gotta be crazy enough where people are like, oh, I could do that kind of crazy, but I wouldn't do that kind of crazy. Why am I sweating all of a sudden? Because you're crazy. Because you're helmet. <laughs> Ready. Right now I'm setting up the shop for both of them to come into this scene. You can kind of see it here, but right now it's a little off balance because I've got two legs on this table. I've got two, one leg on this table. So I have to put it into lock mode. I need to rebalance that. And I'm trying to, the hard part is you have to set it up for a four by five constraint because that's what Instagram allows. It doesn't allow 16 by nine. Well, it does, but it doesn't look good. We like to shoot all our ads in four by five. So that's what I'm setting up right now to make sure that my shot is completely constrained the way it needs to look. All, his, all the lines are perpendicular, not slanted. We've got a big ass problem, and we need your help to solve it. Hey, have you followed me on fans only? Or only fans, yeah? <laughs> and fans only. Have you? Yeah, Hit that subscribe that button. Crappy. You won't be disappointed. <laughs> Wipe up to get one now before they're gone. Hey guys, guess what's back? Mystery boxes, but this time we got small, medium, and large, full of all your favorite DP merch, up to 50% off. Swipe up because they're going fast. Marketing 101 right here. Marketing 102. Get the people's attention. 90210. Marketing 90210. <laughs> I'm jogging to keep up with your walk. Hey, Mark. Yeah. Hey, we got a big ass problem you're about to help us solve. Where? Guys, we got a big ass problem. Day nine. Three. Dude, it's been a solid. <laughs> it's been a week. You've got at least two weeks. Did you try to put yourself at day three? It's been a week. You've been a drone all the we days that you drones. watch YouTube videos learning how to fly drones count as drone days. Also, you've had okay, your drone. You've had your drone. If I go and look on your TikTok, how many drone videos do you have? Five, but they're all the same video. No. Accident number? 15. 15. That's why, <laughs> so, that's why it doesn't fly straight. One, one, of the risks, one of the risks of being a drone pilot is f***ing your up <laughs> and hitting the wall. Here, let me take off. As, uh, as our friend no. uh, Cole, the drone pilot. What if I push the go fly button? He's a co- he's, he's a- go anywhere. He's a second you know command. I saw, I saw that. I saw Let me try. That. We're not sure where the drone's at. Okay. Here's the deal. Flying drones indoors, is for experts. Cole, not quite an expert yet. Shut up. <laughs> Where's your drone, bro? What it's, are you doing up there? there? It's right there on the How did you butter the landing? <laughs> I didn't hear the prop. Or anything. It, he didn't clap. He didn't crash. He just was like, hey. "Whoa, my drone's been weird. I'm gonna land it and then restart." An emergency landing. Yeah. It's trying to take off right now. Why are you? So <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> That had nothing to do with me. That did an automatic. What was the plan? <laughs> what was the plan? It's still. It's alive. Yeah, you need to go up. There you go. Pull up. Pull up. Now you need to slow down. <laughs> you got the drone. Save yeah, it. No. Rex 16. You're gone.
17. You still alive? <laughs> Never mind. How when did, do, when did you get a DJI like swamp? <laughs> Straight how did it, how did it recover and then go straight to the camera? <laughs> <laughs> it hit that, recovered. <laughs> oh, this is your first time flying? You're so good. We have a you drone guy we drum. need to replace <laughs> if you want. You guys are iron? Yeah, it was not me. Dude, you can't be the drone guy and the main guy. <laughs> well, he can vlog no, himself. I don't remember seeing any rules that said I couldn't do it. I think that's totally fine. Cut, you know, <laughs> well, launch in 45 minutes, so. Uh, means I got 45 minutes to this thing. Now that's pod racing. You got it. I like that. <laughs> it's an XLT. I could have done that. That's a good shot. All right. Make it drop. That's that wop. <laughs> got a Beckett bucket and a mop. That's a wop. We started to give you the steps of how to make a marketing video and uh, step number three chimed in, which is initiate pure chaos. So that's got our steps a little mixed up. So what we're going to do is go ahead and back up and give you the steps. Step number one, get people's attention. Step number two, do something different. Step number three, provide value. Step number four, call to action. It's that easy. Step five. Guys, I got good news and I got bad news. So, as you may remember, before, like 88% of you were not subscribed to the channel. But now, that number's gone way down to 68% of you. That's a great jump. So obviously, some of you are starting to get value out of these videos. So what I'm gonna ask, if you enjoy the video, or if you're getting value out of it, do me a favor. Like the video, drop a comment, but most importantly, here's a subscribe button. I need you to smash it! Not easy. Smash! We're getting there, guys. And guess what? When we hit 250,000 subscribers, which we are very, very close to, I'm going to pick one of you. I'm going to grab you, bring you here to the shop, oh. and I'm going to let you pick out any one of my Polaris Power Sports toys, anything like that. Bam. Guys, we are well on our way to building the biggest and the baddest and the best channel on YouTube, thanks to you. Because we can try doing one this way, where we're, we're where I'm sitting and talking to the camera the whole time, rather than standing, and I just reach over, grab it, throw it. A little bit more organized. Cool. Cordy? Cordy? Good cool. job, audio guy. <laughs> Starting with a small mystery box. Bam. This job is legit much easier. I just do. We got 30 minutes before this launches and we've taken 17 takes. So now we got to go back and cut this up in 30 minutes before it actually launches. Do you think you could do that in time, man? Matt can. <laughs> Good. Ready? Bam. Wham. Guys, these boxes are a huge value. Ooh, diesel power gear. Guys, no joke, that is how we do our marketing videos. See, the reason we do it this way is because it's gotta feel, it's gotta feel random, it's gotta feel sporadic, and it's gotta feel fresh and new. So uh, in order to do that, you gotta have a team of guys. It's not just Dave and I. Like, literally the reason why these ads come together is because we got guys like Van. Van is our social media ad optimization guy and our marketing CMO. He's the guy who basically says what to do, when to do it, and how to do it, and how much we're spending, and how much money we're gonna make on what we spend. He's good. He's like, go to a conference and speak to other guys that do this job good. Then you got the former drone pilot. Audio guy. <laughs> now, <laughs> for, former, former drone pilot and the new audio guy. He's also <laughs> part of the Facebook ad optimization team. They're the ones that go in, they buy the ads, they write the copy. They are the ones that make the ads look good. Not Dave and I. They're the ones that make all this shit work. Then you've got Alec. Who is a photographer. He is a fluffer. He's the fan guy. He is a... He's kind of the Leatherman of the bunch. He does whatever we need him to do. Then you have videographer extraordinaire, Mr. Matt Herrera. 
man right here, he's the one who makes the videos look sexy as hell. And then you got Dave. <coughs> Go ahead. Awesome. Go ahead. Take the and that's Dave. Yeah. And then. <laughs> what were you gonna say? What and, was it? And then you got me. And together you have us. You and us makes one. We just showed you how. What did we do? We, this was maybe two hours, Internet. roughly. Um, one thing that you want to make sure that you're doing when you're creating ads, check the audio. If the audio sucks, the ad sucks. Yep. If the picture sucks, the ad sucks. Mm -hmm. So what they do is they'll take all this footage, take it back to the shop, to the office, and they'll spice it up. What do they call it? Ooh. Color grading? Spice. Well, color grading is when you mess with your footage color, but like audio check is correct. We have to make sure that all the levels are right. There's no peaking. There's no noise. We're good. And peaking. we have nope. to condense this into 60 seconds or less because we run these ads on Instagram, Facebook, and then we also run Snapchat ads, which have to be 10 seconds or less, right? Yep. Guys, this is how we do it. This is behind the scenes. This is the magic of how we sell $30 million worth of merchandise every single year. And just like that, here's the finished product. Hey, let me see that. That's it. There you go. Oh, movie magic. It's been it. It's more than I thought. Whoa! You ate it? You ate that? We're supposed to put that out. Oh my God. <laughs> Guys, we got a big ass problem. And we need your help to solve it. Come here. We got a warehouse full of stuff, but we just ordered all of our 2021 stuff. So rather than making you go to the website and buy everything one thing at a time, we created mystery boxes, starting with the small mystery box. Oh, you wanna up the ante? Good, let's go to the medium mystery box full of more miscellaneous stuff. Or we got the large mystery box, including a calendar signed by yours and his truly. Bam, wham, thank you, Dan. These boxes are a huge value. Literally some of this stuff is 50, 60, 70% off and we're just throwing it in because we gotta clear out the warehouse right now. Every mystery box you buy gets you more entries to win the vehicle of the month and the 12 days of Christmas prizes, including iPads, cash, one wheels, and all sorts of prizes. But you have to go right now because guess what? We're almost out.